Hey guys, Ryan with Home Lab Tech Support here, and I have to do a Windows 10 install on a computer that's having some problems. No matter what I've done with this thing, it does not want to accept drivers, so we're just going to wipe Windows 10, save us a little bit of time. But I wanted to show you how, when you're reinstalling Windows, that you can quickly clean the drive without using Linux or booting into other operating systems simply from the Windows installer itself. Once you've booted to the um, Windows installer, if you hold Shift, and F10, you'll get a command prompt. Now, if we type in disk part, I'm doing this one handed and of course this is going great. Uh, we can then do list disk and we will see our physical drives connected to the system. And we can see the SSD that's in there, the one that's 223 gigs, which is disk zero. So we will select S-E-L-E-C-T disk zero. Oh, sorry. Oh, one hand is not working. There we go. We will select disk zero. Make sure your spaces are correct in there. And once it's you have selected your disk, we'll type in clean, C-L-E-A-N. Now, you need to be very, very careful that you've selected the correct hard drive because once you press the enter key in here, you drop the partition table for the hard drive, which means your hard drive is about to show up as if nothing's on there. So before I do that, let me show you. If we do list volume... So right now we're seeing uh, all the hard uh, hard drive partitions, it's late, I'm sorry, um, that are on disk zero, uh, with the exception of volume five, uh, which is from my thumb drive. So if we're still selected on disk zero, so now if we do clean, disk parts successfully succeeded in cleaning the disk, and we go list volume again, well, all of those volumes are gone because there's no more partition table to actually list those partitions. Um, from here, if we just exit out and we go through our installer, isn't it lovely to see yourself in a reflection while making a video? <laughs> Always have the pinky out. Come on. This installer is running off of a USB 2.0 thumb drive, so that's a little bit of the speed issue here. And if we look a little bit further, putty tat. Hi, putty tat. Still waiting. There we go. Hey, good timing. All right, refocus, you fuck. All right, I accept. Next. Uh, custom install and there's our disk completely unallocated so if we just click next at this point we don't even have to make the partitions manually windows is going to make them automatically for us and off to the race as we go well thanks for watching this video my name is ryan with home lab tech support if you're not already subscribed please make sure that you subscribe hit that like button and the bell to be alerted when i upload new videos and i will see you guys later